In this lesson we will prepare a laser machining program and the first step is to select a post processor. I have a laser on the GRBL controller and I will choose PWM laser. Ok. I have already tested this post processor and the machining programs are correct. Then add the tool, click this button and here we cannot define the laser head but we can just define a mill tool but it doesn't really matter. Enter one as the tool code, select mill as tool type, type laser in description field okay enter one for diameter usually i cut out in a way that the tool with its center goes along the machined contour so the diameter doesn't matter the spindle speed parameter determines the laser power and for my laser i can set this value from 0 to 1000 using more power we cut letters faster but uh, we can melt material if the laser power is too high so enter here for example 300 and the feed rate parameter determines the speed of the laser and if the speed is too high and the laser power is too low the letters will not be cut if the speed is too low and the power is too high the edges of the letters may be melted or burnt therefore the laser power and speed must be properly set enter here 100 and here also 100 and click ok to add new tool First we will cut the inside of the letter A and select this geometry and choose Add Profile Toolpath. Ok, in the toolpath section type for example A in and leave the other parameters in this section as default. My laser doesn't have a z-axis, so the parameters from the cutting depth section are irrelevant, except for the passes parameter. I want to prepare the machining in one pass, so I will enter here 1. In the side direction section, set the side parameter to on, and direction parameter doesn't matter. In the lead section, we will also leave the default parameters, and click OK to add the toolpath. OK, I will now prepare the machining for other geometries in a similar way. Select the geometry, select Add Profile Toolpath, here type the name SC, OK, and toolpath is ready, select this geometry, OK, and again select this geometry at profile toolpath and OK. OK. Open the CAM configuration, set the output file, for example laser and C, and click OK. And now click CAM export and the machining program is ready. I will open this program in NC Code Simulator. OK. Here we have our machining program. 